Bar Builds family. It's your boy Kubo back at it again with another little video. Today we um, ordered a customized weighted shift knob from Billet Works. I appreciate Billet Works for that nice discount. Um, we've been collabing on a couple of um, shift knobs from our previous vehicles. Um, but today we're going to be installing one on my 2024 Mustang GT. Um, it's very special to me. I was able to get it exactly how I wanted it. But yeah, um, the purpose for it is so it gives me cleaner shifts, um, crispier, and I don't have to really fidget with the, with the stick shift that much. But yeah, stay tuned for the outcome of that. And I'm going to be dropping more videos for y'all. Finally, got the bad boy here. Let's get it. All right, guys, right here. We got the heavy weighted shift knob right here. Came in out clean. Look at that. We got it in titanium. Yep. And then right here, y'all make sure y'all support Bill It Works as well. If you have a manual transmission vehicle, hit them up. They do really cool products. Make sure you tap in with them. But yeah, um, can't complain. I got it exactly how I wanted it. But this is what we're going to be installing on that GT. All right, guys. Um, here she is. Got that GT right here in the background. And the EG on the left. We're going to be doing some nice work on the EG suit too soon as well. Damn, I can't speak. That my boy. But yeah, check it out. It's right here. This is the one we're going to be getting down on. All right. All right, guys. Here's the, the regular standard GT shift knob that it came with. Obviously, we're going to be replacing this specific one with the one that we got back here. Um, I generally really like doing this modification for my vehicle because... Not only does it make the interior look a little bit better, but just in general, um, to me, it actually feels a lot better when I'm shifting. But yeah, um, stay tuned for how it turns out because it's a quick modification and it definitely gives a nice upbeat to the vehicle. Sheesh. So first of all, you're going to want to put this thing in reverse far left lift it up and put it to the back the reason why you want to do that is because you want no wiggle room when you're um twisting the shift knob to the left to remove it all right now you see it came off um it's gonna look like that that's when you are able to install your next one. You're going to use this little, this little grommet thing to just set it right here so it um, tightens up well with your new one. You can adjust the height by adjusting it and then just make sure that you twist it on right so it does not feel wiggly. But we're going to be doing that now. All right, one of the grommets from that specific little bag, you're gonna put on the actual stem of the of the um, stick shift, so it is able to clamp in the incision inside the shift knob. Next, you're gonna put this one to adjust the height of how you want it. I kind of use a little cheat sheet where I put that specific um grommet inside the the stick because once you stick it in it'll be in there nice and secure but this is the one that's going to allow you to adjust the height that you want on the actual um position of your um shift knob all right guys look that's the outcome of the heavy weighted shift knob installed Looks beautiful. 
check it out got that nice reverse and that one through six and that nice gt in this on the bottom right there gives it a nice little touch up but yeah came out nice no no movement at all nice and snug and got all shifts like butter nice yep make sure y'all tap in with bill at work i'm telling y'all and check them out That's gonna be it for today's video nice clean easy install on the shift knob um, again thanks very much for everyone supporting my channel and just staying on top of my videos um, I got hats for y'all if y'all want to tap in and purchase purchase some also got shirts for y'all um, nevertheless once again um, tap in with billet works for um your shift knob needs um thank you very much once again from the bottom of my heart i appreciate it god bless you all and stay tuned for more videos